Okay, we have a fault which is saying that the needle change motor is not in default state, all needles in jump stitch, otherwise risk of mechanical fault, press operating leader or press green start key trying to resolve problem. Actuate. We have an error saying that the main shaft is not in the stopping position. The cause of this fault has been a positional error introduced by the operator. As it was sewing, the needle has driven down into the hoop. So we know we've had a crash, we know that we've had an impact in the needle to the hoop. This error here is telling us that this sensor on our motor here is not telling us that we're in the right spot. So this is a sensor that should double check the position of the main shaft at 64 degrees. We come out of this into service. We see on this that we're at 65.7, which is close enough to 64 degrees. The position that we've got here is not reading correctly. Using our 8mm shaft, or base of an 8mm drill bit, into our head timing position with our brake off. At this point, our 8mm shaft is in position. I turn the brake back on, which locks the machine in that position. And we can see up on this end, that our head sensor is actually reading correct position. So as far as our head timing position is, with our 64 degree pin in place, we're reading our head in a correct position. We're reading at 88.9 degrees, however, which means there's a difference between our heads and our main shaft. On this particular machine, this underneath is our main shaft encoder, and that's at the end of our main shaft. So this is what's giving us our angular position. Our head drive is coming from this belt. The belt is coupled to our main shaft underneath here. Okay. So yeah. So we have a coupling, two clamp bolts either side. We also have our clutch here for our take up. But first thing we're going to do is time our main shaft to our head. Just gently releasing both sides of this coupling. Enough so that we have the ability to turn. Now, if a second person could please go up to the sensor at the top and tell us when we're at 64 degrees. So if your camera go around. So the 64 degrees is the readout of this shaft. 106, 114, 87, 70, 61, 54, 56, 55, 58, 62, 63.5, 6.6, 64.6, 64.2. That's pretty close. Okay, we've got a clamp up. Actually, this is saying 64 degrees. Okay, we've got a clamp Stays on 64, 2. 63, 9, 64, 64, 0. 
62.9 in fact. Okay, I've actually got a timing mark down here at 63. I'm going to set it to 63. Okay. It's fluctuating between 63 and a half and 64 and a half. Sixty-three four now. Sixty-three five. Sixty-three one. Alt Z. Going to try our needle change operation again. 11 X. Now it's saying fault eliminated, ready to go. Shut down.